Five years ago, that cry of five million echoing across the nation at the Women's March. People in Kern County also taking those steps for a better future for females. Co-director Robin Walter says 5,000 each year in 2018 and 2019. Never imagined that it would be so uh, inspiring here in Kern County. And I think everybody felt at that moment, and I hope they're continuing to feel the need to protect women and women's rights and uh, pursue really a fair system for everybody. Now the Women's March normally commences here at Mill Creek Park with people holding signs like this. But while there's not a physical march on Saturday, Walter says the real work happens every single day. When we volunteer, when we canvass, when we phone bank, we have women involved in unions, we have women involved in health care, we have women involved in um, the distribution of vaccines and masks. Walter's adding there's still work to be done. On the 49th anniversary of Roe v. Wade Saturday, Walter's mentioning reproductive rights and health. Income equality and work disparities are another factor. According to the Better Bakersfield Boundless Current 2021 Market Assessment, women in Kern County are 40% more likely than men to be out of work across age and education levels. And among those working, men are more likely to have the better jobs. I think the pandemic has demonstrated uh, the inequality that women face because so often women are both caregivers and breadwinners. But Walter says there's hope. The nonpartisan march has inspired participants to step forward in our community in positions of power and influence to make positive change. In recent years, many women are declaring their intent to run for office. Most recently, Supervisor Leticia Perez running for state assembly, and she's not the only woman running. We have seen women transform their own lives, and by that, the lives of their community. They've run for office, they've become involved, they've become activists, they're speaking out for their community. And so all those things are what we stand for, not just marching down the street on one day a year. In Bakersfield, Kristen Vartan, 23 ABC News, connecting you.